if you've ever logged into the game and you see that all these uh, miscellaneous traffic type airplanes are just pink, they've got the checkerboard pattern on them, and they're just pink, that's because they're not loading up the textures. Now I'm going to show you the way that I fixed it, but I'm also going to show you the way that I figured that out. So what you'll want to do is go out to uh, General Options and go into Developers and turn on Developer Mode and then just resume. And when you go into uh, here, go into Debug and Console, more specific here, yeah, just go into Debug and Console. You're looking for warnings, little yellow triangles. And so what we're looking for is um, anything that references these generic aircraft, and this is what we'll find. Um, the Asobo aircraft generic planes, whether it's the piston engine planes, whether it's the airliners, here's another one, they'll all be the same way. And there, there's other files that are missing here as well. Not, not worried about those as far as the pink planes go. It, but all of these pink planes are due to this kind of stuff. So like here's generic turbo multi turbo multi engine. Somewhere in here there's going to be private jet. There's going to be airliners. Yep, there's an airliner. So that's what that's the problem, is that it's missing a folder. And you'll see that it's a Sobo generic whatever texture. Just that name and then texture. So let's go look at the file system and I'll show you what's actually going on here. And so this is, the, mine's installed from the uh, actual Microsoft Store. If it's under Steam, the files will be in a little bit different place. But if you just do a search in your file system for the aircraft generic, this is Sobo aircraft generic folder, you'll find them. And each of these, if I go into sim objects, airplanes, etc., they're going to have these texture folders with numbers after them, and these are different sets of textures. These are the different liveries, but there's no folder here that's just called texture, and that's where this falls apart. Now, in my case, I think it happened after a patch. Um, I'm sure there's multiple ways that this can happen, but no matter what, that's why you're seeing the pink pink planes is that the texture folder is missing. So the quick and easy way to fix this is to just select the generics, these generic folders, and delete them. And then start the start the simulator. So I'll cut here and I'll rejoin after it started up or next when it gets to the uh, downloading part. Okay, so when you come back, you're going to come back to this, and basically it's saying I'm missing files. I need to update some stuff, and so it, it's noticed that there's content missing. The installer is automatically going to go get it. So just click update, and so now I've got to wait for all of this stuff to download. So I won't make you wait through that. I'll rejoin you when this is finished. Okay, so we're back to this. I'm going to go turn off the debug options. We don't need them anymore. I am that confident that it worked. And so let's go back to this world map. Go back to the same airport, which was... And the pink planes are gone. I do have to... So do we have any planes in sight? Yeah. So the airliners are over there at the gates. There's one over here on the left. And they are no longer pink. 
So that's that. That's all there is to it. The file system got corrupt. Delete the folder. Let the game download it again from scratch. And you should be up and running. I hope it helped.